Hello and welcome to Ego Trip, your ticket to the hubris of Pixar fandom. I'm Thomas Larson, recording live from my home in Sacramento, California. Nowhere near Pixar. <laughs> uh, regardless, I have a passion for the company that stretches beyond the 100 mile distance between our locations, so uh, I'd like to take you inside the heart of the company one crucial figure at a time. Do enjoy. In anticipation of the new movie Toy Story 3, millions of fans are waiting for the next big movie from Academy Award winning director John Lasseter. Well, they'll have to wait a little longer, considering that Toy Story 3 is in fact directed by Lee Unkrich, and not John Lasseter. And who is Lee Unkrich? Not exactly a household name. Actually, you probably didn't notice his name rolling through the credits of some of your favorite Pixar movies. Co-director of Toy Story 2, co-director of Monsters Incorporated, and co-director of Finding Nemo. And keep in mind that all three of these movies were being developed simultaneously. That's right. He's the guy with the chimp from the Monsters, Inc. special features. Whatever happened to that chimp? Clearly, Lee has some experience with this whole directing thing. Actually, what Lee is most notorious for is his skill in nonlinear film editing, which is what he studied and what got him a job at Pixar, acting as supervising editor for many of their films. Born in 1967, Lee graduated from the USC School of Cinematic Arts. He was quickly grafted into the vine as a nonlinear editor and picked up a 15-year part-time gig at Pixar. It's likely that the cinematic quality of the early Pixar movies can be greatly attributed to Lee's editing and visualizing skills. So it comes as no surprise that he was pulled around between three movies that were being simultaneously developed and still managed to pull co-director status from all three of them. It's pretty impressive if you ask me. Of course, after Toy Story 3 is released, Lee Unkridge might very well become a household name. He certainly has the credentials to pull it off. So why am I talking about Lee now? To beat everyone to the punch, of course. <laughs> this is Ego Trip, after all. With our journey ended, I invite you to venture into the hubris of Pixar fandom again. I'm Thomas Larson. I'll see you in the ending credits.